Hello team Gemini, it's Empire333 here. Welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all well and safe. Gemini, this is your love tarot card reading. Any placements in Gemini or if you're dealing with one, you're welcome to be here. So I will be getting into Oracle and intuitive messages, of course, as always, and each person's energy with these cards. So, and we'll get into spiritual advice if spirit thinks you need it at this time. So Gemini, I'm, I'm intuitively picking up that your energy is fragmented. So I don't know where you're putting your energy, okay? Or um, you might be feeling like you can't focus at this time, okay? So let's see what is going on. Spirit, what do you want to tell Gemini? Also, um, if you want a personal reading, that link is down below. That information is down below. I'm not doing extended for this video, guys. Okay. Yeah. That makes total sense. All right. So, Gemini, I feel like a lot of you, um, there's something about a connection that was broken, okay? Some kind of love connection here. What I'm seeing here is that what's happening is that um, a lot of negativity out of your life lifted, okay? As you broke up with someone or someone broke up with you. It doesn't matter who broke up with who. That's not the point, <laughs> Okay? I feel that there's a lot of negative lower energy that has been lifted. That's what I'm hearing, okay? And yet, I feel that you still, okay, whether this is a loving man, loving woman, it doesn't matter. There was someone who, you know, you are thinking about at this time, even though I feel like you're both apart. And it has a lot to do with hidden motivations. So I feel that you're still questioning what this person's motivation was to be with you. Um, what were their intentions to be with you? And what I'm seeing here, which I don't like for you, Gemini, because I want you all to be, you know, abundant and happy and whatever, is that because you're still stuck in that energy, it's affecting something else in your life that you're not like it, it's a goal or it's a you know it's like a goal being fulfilled or dream coming true i feel like a lot of you are still stuck in the energy of this person okay they made a big impact on your life is what i'm hearing okay and some of you, it's like you painted a picture or this person. Okay, thank you, Spirit. Spirit, Spirit just connect, corrected me. This person painted a picture like you all were going to be together. Um, you saw it as, you know, you're going to maybe move in with this person. You're going to marry this person. You're going to have a family with them. It was like that kind of thing. And now that this person's gone... Even though you feel more free, Gemini, you feel free, right? It's like you're you're still in the energy of that's probably why it feels like fragmented energy. Okay, so I'm gonna see about this person, Spirit. What can you tell us about Gemini's person with this tarot deck? Okay, good. Just want to make sure I'm still recording. Okay. Hold on, guys. That's too many. Gemini's person, spirit. Okay, there's a three of swords that wants to come out, and I'm going to take it. Okay. So this person could have, you know, put you in a uh, three of cups. Okay, that totally makes sense. I was gonna, about to say, I feel what with this card, okay, that's not what this card always means, but I already got a third party here, okay? So somebody here was affecting this connection. So 
This is really in interesting, okay? I'm just going to say what's coming out, guys. So this person is a attention 304, okay? 304, however you say that. Um, this person just loves getting attention, okay? And what I feel here is that there's something that has to do with the world wide web is what I'm hearing. Okay, I don't know who this is going to make it. It's like this person... I feel loves attention and what happens is is that they just go to where attention is going to get them okay they just go to that they go to status so if somebody has status they go to them okay now listen up guys I'm not saying this is a bad person okay I'm just saying they love attention over anything okay and it doesn't matter whether they care for you or love you, they still love attention, okay? It doesn't matter. So some of you might be questioning, like, why is it, you know, I know this person had feelings with me. I know that they were real. So Spirit's saying here, it doesn't matter. They still love attention, okay? So it's kind of like saying, you know, in a sense where, like, okay, this person, you know how they, you get like those cliches online and they say like, oh, you know, if, if they loved you, then they wouldn't cheat on you. Okay. That is far from the truth. Some people that love people cheat on people. Okay. So Gemini, what I'm trying to tell you here is that this person's ego overtakes them. Okay. And their ego wants attention. They want passion and they want it from numerous people okay so regardless of the fact I do feel like this person cares about you in their own way okay there's a lot of levels to caring and loving someone I don't feel like this person um like treated you the way you wanted to be treated. Let's just be real here, okay? So I'm going to see what your attention, I mean, what your energy, God, they keep going to attention, attention about this person. Like they love attention. They want all these people around them constantly. So this person might be a party person. Um, they might like to drink, okay? Yeah. This is interesting, Gemini. So I feel like you, like, all this, this had a lot of drama, this situation. And you walked away from it. Some of you thought, like, okay, this is my soulmate. Um, this is my person, okay? Because there was some type of soulmate energy in the beginning of this connection. But what I'm hearing here is that it's, it's a very strong connection that you had with this person, but it's like this person gave you a lot of ups and downs with your emotion, okay? They made you feel uneasy. They made you feel unstable because of your emotions. Your emotions were out of balance. That's what you felt around this person. And now that you walked away, it's like... Um, the clouds are lifted, okay, and you're trying to move on. You don't want to go back to the past because this person put you in a very compromising position is what I just heard, okay? They did you dirty is what I just heard, but this is about you um, making the decision to move on. But what I feel like what's happening is like you could be searching this person's social media or something like that trying to get information about them and you see them with other people or you see them um, like partying or whatever it is. And when you do that, for some reason, you want this person to reach out to you. Okay. I don't know why you would want that. Um, maybe you want to tell them something. I don't know. Okay. Let's see though. Why? Why? 
I think some of you, you just want your apology from this person, okay? I feel like a lot of you did not get an apology from this person. You expect them to give you apology for them lying to you or betraying you in some way. It could have to do with the third party, you all. Okay, Gemini, I know this is a heavy reading, but Spirit wants you to know this because I feel like some of you still want an apology from this person. And Spirit's saying you might not ever get that, so don't wait around for it, okay? Just because they give you apology does not mean anything. Just to let you know. Yeah, and that's keeping you, see, this, this is how you need to heal. So some of you are going through a healing experience, okay, right now, after you left the situation, and this is about you and what you invest your time in. This is about you and what borders you have, borders, boundaries, thank you, spirit, boundaries you have set up when it comes to somebody's energy. Who can tap, who can get into your energy, right? That's what it is. So I feel that definitely there was like a triangle here or a couple triangles some of you dealt with and this is about you healing through this. This is not about you knowing which way to go because you're waiting on someone to give you an apology. No, no, no. Spirit's saying no. You heal on your own, okay? Let it go. And some of you are still, you know, you're, how should I say this? Okay, yeah. I already talked about that like this person whether they care about you or not it has to do with the, the levels of caring and love okay because there's so many different types of levels of love but I feel like this truly was a lower level okay this was not a, about the higher levels of love okay and so what this person is doing at this time like they're keeping you stuck okay in a karmic cycle right here okay the cycle is very karmic by the way but i want you to really focus on your healing gemini that's what spirit is saying and free yourself okay free yourself and um you like move on with your life okay because i see for a lot of you that your career was affected because of this person and now your career is going to take a, like a height. Your, your career is going to, um, how, it's, your career is going to take flight, okay? Once you let go of the energy, because you feel like this person is keeping you stuck, but it's all an illusion in your head is what spirit is saying, okay? It's all an illusion. This person, I feel, you feel that this person has some type of power over you, Okay? And Spirit's saying you don't. That's just in your head, okay? You have power within yourself. Bring out your own power as you heal, okay? So let me see what this person's next moves are. Oh, okay. Sorry, Gemini. Okay, I ran out of space. So this person is trying to move on, but I still feel that they are they keep wondering what you're doing where you are what you're up to i feel like they want you to chase them okay so they want you because it's their ego their ego so big this person wow ginormous is what i just heard okay you know it's that kind of thing where it's like i want the last say okay um there is a lot of secrets that's underneath this person, okay? They got a lot of secrets. They got a lot of things going on, okay? This is the death card. I'm not seeing this as transformation. I'm seeing this as a um, secrets they've been hiding. So this person might try, okay, to come towards you, like to come clean, but it's not going to be like, oh, so, you know, we're going to be together and whatever. I just, I still feel like, I 
don't know. I'm not getting a good vibe from them. I'm sorry, Gemini. And some of you might love this person or whatever, but I feel that this person, like every step they take has to do with their ego. They're very deep in their ego, okay? And it's like, even though they feel like they have feelings for you, they still work like that. And they work it for their betterment. They don't work it for your betterment, okay? Um, this person only thinks about themselves is what I'm hearing. Anything else we need to know about this person? Spirit. Yeah. Definitely, um, there is some kind of justice. There's a lot of karma in this connection, okay? You share a lot of bad karma with this person, Gemini. So it might have been really hard for you. But this person is going to move on. I feel like they might have, they might be in another connection or they will be in another connection, okay, that they feel kind of bound to. This person, yeah, like I said, um, yep, yeah. And like I said, they're going to be defensive, okay? So regardless of the fact, if they reach out to you, for some of you, you will... This person will reach out to you somehow. It's it's kind of like it's still f like a, in a fighting energy. It's not like, okay, I'm sorry about what I did and, you know, let me clear the air. No, it has to do with the ego, okay? So um, Spirit's message for you is to heal and move on, um, okay? Heal the heart. Heal your heart space, Gemini. Ooh, I love it, okay, because as you do this, like I said, your car the karmic wheel is going to turn on your side. This is great fortune, okay? This is wish fulfillment. So as you do this, something amazing is coming towards you, okay? Look at, look at that. I can't make this up. The Ace of Cups, okay? New love. New love's around the corner is what they just said, Okay? So keep on healing, Gemini. Don't focus your energy on the past. This person is very deep in the ego. I'm telling you. Like, I don't think they're going to change. I'm just saying, all right? I hope that this has helped you. Let me know how you resonate down below. And peace out.